What is going on guys? My name is Ron back again from Mom Reviews here, and I'm ready to jump into another episode of the Quintessential Quint Quintuplets. Season 2, Episode 6, The Last Exam. Uh, last episode, we were starting to get a little bit more views on Ichika's perspective, with seeing how she acted, um, literally how she acts, and just, just the dynamic with all the sisters now that the bonds have been basically healed um, and recovered. And with the title of this episode, The Last Exam, we're gonna do the last exam. Um, in all, and this was like, if X or Y didn't happen, uh, the father was saying to uh, Itsuki, um, he was gonna go enroll them into a completely different school. They wouldn't see each other anymore, them and Futaru. Uh, so uh, there's a lot at stake going on. And I don't remember, I, I do remember that they pass i mean it's pretty obvious um i i believe it was just by the skin of their teeth or just i forget what's going to happen if there is like a a loophole that i i don't remember again i haven't seen the series since i've rewatched it or reread it uh so it, my memory is not the best i will admit um uh, but i'm ready to jump into this episode so guys without further ado let us jump in to the Quintessential Quintuplet Season 2, Episode, what is it, 6? Episode 6. <laughs> Starting in 3, 2, 1, let's jam. <laughs> What's up, Nino? It's gonna be all gung ho about it. <laughs> opening. Oh, no, no opening. I'm fine with that. You're damn right, you know. I love how she, that's what she's more focused on than the actual exam. Probably not a good thing, but... I'm fine with it. <laughs> she's gung-ho about it, too. Thinking something, yeah, that's what I was thinking. Is it what? Is it dark chocolate? <laughs> All you Miko fans right there just got a little bit of a ooh. That's what it's, that's what she's doing. <laughs> Is that a JoJo's reference? <laughs> Maybe One Piece. <laughs> I 
Nino's good at cooking. Yeah. It's a good, uh, good impersonation right there. It's a, it's a girl thing. It's something they experience 12 times a year. Around. <laughs> yes. Mm. I actually forgot about this. Shark teeth, beauty mark. She's wife. She's a waifu. I actually don't even remember her from the original. No, oh, you said the wrong thing. Ah. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not talking much. How do you mess up chocolate, by the way? <laughs> mm. 
Yeah, Nina's a good cook. Why would you throw away a reference book? <laughs> Unfortunately, she she's talking about the same person. <laughs> wow, Nina, you made her cry. <laughs> Totally a Sunday. Totally a Sunday. But that's what makes, you know, great. Sundays are great. I mean, Nino's great, so. <laughs> it's a big ass book. She still has the mark on her hand. <laughs> She's a little bit too gung, gung ho. <laughs> Him with a uh, facial hair is not <laughs> what I would say. <laughs> Every time. I'm still waiting if we're going to get the Ichika uh, adaptation, because that's a good, that's great. <laughs> Internal struggle he's having. You gotta have a break, you can't constantly, yeah. You're gonna burn yourself out. Yes. Burnout. <laughs> they can afford this, right? <laughs> Right. 
running around somewhere. <laughs> She's sending those too. Yotsuba. Yotsuba. I mean, that is the easiest way to tell. <laughs> yeah, it's not a secret. They all failed. Well, yeah. <coughs> not, not what I meant. Sorry. Yosuba is a very selfless person. Man to man. man. You mean man to woman? Fun fact, I've actually been on the world's largest um, Ferris wheel. The Link, Las Vegas. I mean, I do live there, so it also helps. But I've never been on it. <laughs> What's Nino and uh eat scheme get at? I had you know, I don't remember much of this. This this is actually a really good uh heart to heart. This is really giving her some confidence. Which is really needed for Yotsuba. Cuz Yotsuba is a very selfless and um she she doesn't hold herself to a really high standard. Out of the, she has the lowest self esteem. So, this actually is really good for her.
It is a nice feeling. I'll admit. I've had that happen to me. I actually was a tutor back in elementary and middle school. Meanwhile, you know, you're just, just leaving. <laughs> he ate it. He said my chuckles were good. My heart. It's not what you think. <laughs> okay, that was good. That was funny. It's over, Ichika. I have the high ground. I mean, a teacher and soon has not stopped things from happening, especially in America. <laughs> and from the passages I've read in Japanese. I don't think I've ever uh, sl fallen asleep from um, overstudying. Actually, very I didn't study that much. It's also real afflicted. Hey, as long as he passed. Seventy. So what did each guy got? Two forty. Oh, my God, I got that right. I, I totally guess I don't remember. Yeah, what did Nino got? Two twenty eight. Totally guessing. <laughs> I took the belt. Two oh nine. Okay. <sighs> Good. 
Good guy, Futaro. Good guy, Futaro. Alright. So, no opening and ending. It was a jam-packed episode with a lot of information. Um, apologize if I don't seem like I had a lot of energy. Uh, reasons. Reasons. Um, but hopefully you enjoyed this episode reaction. Uh, let me know what you guys thought. Um, Ichika is going... Ichika and Miku's relationship are going to be very interesting uh, later on as we continue on. So I think it's going to be a very good and interesting um, dynamic between the two of them. So yeah. Uh, again, I apologize for my clear lack of uh, energy. A lot of stuff's been going on. Um, don't really want to go into it. it has nothing to do with uh, this channel. So keep personal and business aside. <laughs> I guess even though this is definitely just a hobby, I, I do this for fun. Um, but yeah. Uh, let me know what you guys thought in the comment section below. Uh, as always, I read all of your guys' comments. And in regards to The Promise of Land, because uh, I know some people are probably going to be asking, like, oh, where's the reactions? I'm dropping the series. Um, in terms of reactions. Will I continue watching it? Probably. Um, I'm probably not going to watch it today, in all honesty. I think just the fact that I'm seeing the amount of, like, backlash against the anime... Um, and just the significant amount of people who just don't watch it. I mean, even with my first season reactions, um, I was hardly getting trans um, traction. And still to this day, I never got anything past really a thousand views. Um, and I think that's just a clear sign that it's not a show that does well. Um, I had problems last week. Uh... And I heard Funimation was still having some problems uh, from one of my friends who's, who uses my account as well. So, I'm just not going to take the risk and uh, go from there. Um, I'll watch it on my own time. I don't even really want to do breakdowns. Again, people do not like the this anime adaptation. Um, and I just see a lot of negativity about it around it. So, I kind of want to distance myself from that show. But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys soon. I'm, I might live stream in the next couple days i don't know um but yeah um thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you guys next time see ya